Welcome, Welcome back, back pop, pop stars. stars. I'm Rizzo. I'm Benji. And today we are watching oh. my oh my RuPaul Drag Race episode. Look at that. Crew better work. <laughs> They're like, wait, is that the same Rizzo? No. It's absolutely the same Rizzo, and we're gonna watch through. It's not because emotionally I'm different. <laughs> yeah, no, I hate people. <laughs> oh my god! I haven't watched this in years. Same. Oh god, I really hate hearing my voice. Come on! That's why I don't really rewatch our videos the way you rewatch them. Oh, I rewatch them all the time. All right, you ready, Benji? Three, Three two, two, one, one engage! engage. Yeah, I mean, it was cute. I did what I had to do. But for me, this is like not like a happy moment. This is not group therapy. This is a competition. This is not RuPaul's best friend. This is not <laughs> RuPaul's best friend race. <laughs> there it is. That doesn't mean we don't support Nina. I'm over and I'm over it. Say she it, Trinity. No, no, no. I mean, I would never say it because I worked with these ladies. Like, that would be so shitty of me. Be like, send them home. I know they all got to go. With extra special guest judges. I was mad, too, because I joined this show. I was... The the yes. oh, fuck, I forgot and Kesha. I guess to meet Kesha. Um, I'm so salty. Duncan, about. the AD who got me onto this, he had me finishing up a show while he started this one, and he was like, "Once you sign the NDA, then I can tell you who our first guest host judge was." Uh huh. It was fucking Lady Gaga. Oh my god. And I didn't get to meet Lady Gaga. Hello, hello, hello. But this season promises to be the most extra special one of all. Oh God, I don't want to see her, her being me. <laughs> and we don't have Why? to look no. any further uh, she's so than cute. just behind the camera. Oh God, I was so nervous. Oh God, <gasps> look he's a piece at of him. shit. He's a, oh, I fucking love Sarge though. And let me tell you, when they did the promo, oh God, me and my roommate at the time were watching uh -huh. your follower count go up throughout <laughs> the night, and we were just like, God damn it. <laughs> God, he's such a baby. His tooth is probably still snaggled as well. Hurried up in drag. You talking about you? Yes. Yes. <laughs> this is not me anymore. <laughs> That's you. Sorry. Sarge is amazing, by the way. Yeah. My mom. Sarge killed it. Loved killed Sarge. It. I did. In yeah. real life. Rizzo. Oh, oh God. Oh. Rizzo. No! Yes. <laughs> Oh, I love it. God, it's so painful. <laughs> so how did they pick who it was? Did they pick or did y'all go, ah, I'll do it? And then they were like, we need like nine volunteers or something. One of the reasons why reality shows flourish during strikes is that they don't even have writers. Technically, they have story producers. I'm Rizzo. I am a set PA. Oh, God, is that my voice? Make sure that they're in drag when we tell them to be in drag. <laughs> is that my voice? Now I want you to share with them firsthand the miracle of drag. Yeah, the story, what are they called? Story producers? They would have come up with their ideal list. They reached out to people, and whoever said yes, said yes. And nice. they came up okay. to me, I said yes. Of course you Back did. then, I was also super Christian. I was like, I hope my Christian parents don't have... I wasn't super Christian. I just was still identifying as Christian. I was like, I hope my Christian parents... And you were still, you were still in it. We really try and match the girls up with someone that at least feels like their personality will match up well. Okay. Peppermint, we are putting Sarge. They did so good together. I, they really yeah. fucking did. Who do you choose for Trinity? Rizzo. <laughs> <laughs> they were like, no doubt. Well, that was because behind closed doors, Trinity was just thirsting over me all the time. Well, of course, yeah. That would definitely be the, if somebody has like a crush, you're like, well, who am I gonna pair them with is their fucking crush. Now remember, the judges will be looking for a strong drag family resemblance. Oh my God, so, though. Don't. I did, I had so much fun with Trinity. Like, yeah. That was a blind. People still to the same like, are you gonna do drag again? I'm like, if I have someone like Trinity to, taking care of shit, yeah. like that takes so much it, skill. One of my major inspirations for drag is Naomi Campbell. That strength, that power, that That's confidence. Good Josh was great. Josh was like super game for anything. So like, what are some female celebrities that come to mind? I would think Penelope Foreman. Natalie Portman? Yeah. She, she don't really match with the Kool-Aid brand. Yeah. I want you to just give me like your best. Like Natalie Portman? Walk. Let me have it. Okay. You couldn't give me like a Beyonce? Oof. That was a little bit rigid. 
I know your mama don't walk like that. <laughs> <laughs> There's a moment I'm kind of bummed was cut out, but She's when they mind. do the whole at the table conversations. Oh. Have you ever seen a dog walk in snow? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It's just like that. Um, Rue asked what I used to do, and I was like, oh, I used to be- Stop talking about that walk. <laughs> I used to be in costumes at like Six Flags, and Rue brought up how like Bugs Bunny was one of his first drag inspirations. Oh, great. So it was like, it was like a little kismet that like yeah. I had been Bugs Bunny before at Six Flags, and Rue was like, Bugs is a little queer. And we're like, yeah, we know. Yeah, we know. Yeah, Whoever we says Bugs isn't queer has never been watching Looney Tunes. This week's maxi challenge is to turn the drag. Yeah, your walk wasn't that bad to start with. I have a sister. I have a gay best friend. I've been surrounded by women my whole life. I didn't think I was going to be amazing, but. How do you feel about tucking? Was that actually your reaction? Or did they add something else? I don't else? remember. That was, was almost a decade ago. God, he's put cute. that tooth back in your mouth. Ooh, look at him. He's so cute. God damn. Uh, I haven't had that Ooh, hairline dang. in forever either. <laughs> Oh God, Duncan. <laughs> Duncan and I's relationship was like JD and Dr. Cox from Scrubs. Uh, okay, yeah. <gasps> no, you're sick. Hey, like, how does how that feel? Duncan is so ready. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, they had been working together for years, so. Oh, yeah. My son will probably have pointers on how I walk in heels. Yeah. <laughs> and like, <laughs> since he was two, he loves clomping around in my wives. I feel like having kids at some point, you've probably put on a wig and a dress with them. <laughs> <laughs> you know, especially if you guys get divorced and then you have to spy on them by pretending to be the, the British babysitter. I'm assuming that's um, Mrs. Doubtfire. Now, Duncan, you have seen the queens come and go. What advice have you given Sasha? To try and stay out of your own head. Mm. Oh, Sasha is way too intellectual, <laughs> in a good way. How do you do that? Drugs. <laughs> Drugs. Gorgeous. Oh, Damn that's it. That's a oh. great earring. <laughs> Love it. I think in retrospect, they wish Sarge would have won over me, I, but he didn't. Have you been here? No, Spoiler I know. Spoiler alert. <laughs> I know. When I was watching it, I was like, not to be like not supportive of my friend, but I'm surprised that Sarge didn't win. I know. <laughs> I was too. Oh, I'm real. very interested in watching it now and seeing what my removed to, be able to document those. God, I love Sarge. Experience. Sarge was just like, you just wanted to hug him all the time. Say it with a little more sass, honey. Girl, I cannot wait to show you. <laughs> yes. Why did Why did I win? I can't wait to see it. <laughs> okay. Why did I win? Again? You're cute. You're I am. Hey, she's in you. <laughs> what else am I gonna say? No? Like, no, no, I'm not. You gotta play coy. You and your new sisters in drag need to prepare a lip sync performance to my song, Click Clack. Click Clack. Oh, this is giving me anxiety all over again. Hey, it. hey, you already did it. You already did good and you already won. Oh, Spoiler Trini, alert. I didn't realize that you were serving some shrimp cocktail with your uh, makeover. You worry That's about cute. your man. What does that mean? I don't know. My feet are fine. <laughs> Shut up. I played it off though. He said, e -e -e. I was now I'm insecure. <laughs> Coming up. Ugh. This hurts. What the f get the f out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I was really pissed off. And I and I cannot remember who it was, but I'm pretty sure she was the sweetest camera person ever. And she was like, they just they told me to and I later was like, no, I know. I know they told you. But, but in the also, moment I was like, get the f get the fuck, fuck out of here. <laughs> Duncan is feeling the fantasy. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, Sarge, you beautiful <laughs> man, you. <laughs> With the heels. I love Sarge so okay. much. Okay. <laughs> this was the first time I'd ever worked with any of these people outside of Duncan. I wish I could have done this like. A few more times. Uh, like season two or three for yeah. me. <laughs> it's like the Little Mermaid. It's the Little Mermaid. Except <laughs> she was a big dude. <laughs> Except her. See, that was good. That was shade. Shut okay. the fuck up. <laughs> Shut up, shading Rizzo. Yeah, what'd they say? I said, oh, it's like the Little Mermaid, but if it was like a big dude or something, I don't know, something stupid. And they it, said... They said it was good shade, but that was like 2016. Oh, they said you were shade. You were. You I were was shady. shady. Oh, okay. All I was saying though is I wish I would have known this crew better because like I could see the joy on both Sarge and Duncan's faces. Just like Being we've been filming this for so long. Seasons, yeah. We get to actually be a part of this. Yeah. The reason I particularly was doing this was because I've never really agreed with how we've divided men and women when it comes to what's strong. So to me, like. This is very I'm trying to hopefully this doesn't this holds up fit in that specific. I think mold. it does. Right. Yeah. I know what it's like to kind of 
not particularly fit the jock mold. <laughs> what are you talking about? Look up the idiot. It's like beauty and strength are kind of synonymous. Yeah. Oh, you need to be surrounded by numerous different Look walks of life. Look at you. Look at uh, you. That was so much less cultured back then, too. Exactly. But because you had that basis, you're able to get to where you are. I'm definitely surprised by talking with Rizzo. I feel the same way. Being a human being is so much more than being put into a box or a label. You are who you are. Damn, I'm proud of Trinity. That was a good ass. She was literally like fucking like, like, like get... sewing her ass off. <laughs> and we got it. I'm pretty sure we were the first people to get everything done. Yeah. And when I say Ow. we, I mean how Trinity. is that? Didn't you forget to shave something too? Yeah, my literal ass crack. <laughs> I shaved everywhere. They're like, oh no. And honey. then I went to Trinity. I was like, I didn't do my ass crack because I didn't want to put the blade in there. And she went, I think with my vibe with this. Well, that's going to be the worst part for you. <laughs> that sucks. But I feel more confident in who I am when I got clean. Oh my God. I was like, who is wow. that? For anybody in my drag family, the number one rule is a fierce tuck. It did not hurt. Everyone, they're like, how's it going? I feel like, come on. You ain't supposed to be playing tug of war. I was masturbating, I mean, Trinity. I mean, ouch. I hope not. That's the opposite of where match. we wanted to go. <laughs> you ain't even got to the duct tape part Hold yet. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Ball keeps He's, like trying to poke out more than the other. We're gonna see, like, look, didn't mind Trinity, but then fucking costume around this. The judges okay, know there was no... that I can do a fierce tuck. Okay, let's this just say there was. Right. Yeah, I know there was no fucking drama. Okay. I was gonna do that tuck. See. They yeah. have to make it seem like I wasn't gonna do it. Right. Well, no, I don't think it came off that you weren't gonna do it. No, I mean, I'm talking about these like in betweeners. I feel like the in betweeners were more just like a, it has to be perfect, not just it has what to be done. Get the f out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Well, he's an ally, but he's an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> and it's always been the case. <laughs> oh, God. I was like, get the fuck. That's amazing. This was probably one of my favorite great. Great of hooks. hers. I love that. The black, the jazz Kesha. And he was the designer, the other, the other judge. Yes. Again, the, the dick being taped up into my ass did not hurt. Yeah. What hurt was about an First hour up, or two into Trinity this, Taylor I had to fucking piss something day. fierce. Ladies yeah. and gentlemen, the Cheetah Girls. Yes. Also, Benji, you want to talk about this how we came up with that name? Oh, absolutely. I'm going to pause. Did we, did we get to the Glitter for Days part? Where well, they, are we sure? Where they, they asked already the called me. No, because that was the part that was deleted. <laughs> oh. So I'm going to pause it. Okay, so we got So long story short, no, 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 long story long, go okay, for it. Okay, long story long, my first or second week into it, I was in charge of like cleaning up the room before like the cameras would come in. There was glitter all over the floor and I was like, God damn, there's glitter for days here. And then I, into my brain went, ha, that'd be a great stripper name. I was like, that's fantastic, but it's Glitifa. Glitifa. Glitifa days. Yep. And I was like, that's so. And I was like, ha, ha, ha. I'll oh. never need that. And, and so then it was <laughs> What were the odds? Like a week <laughs> later. And the best part was I wish they would have kept it. And it was like the one thing I was really, uh, but in that same conversation about like Bugs Bunny, I used to do character work at Six Flags. So this shouldn't be too much of a difference for me. Rue went, so do you know your drag name? And without even like, not without even a, a second a thought, I went, Glitter for days. And Rue was like, oh, oh. <laughs> oh I'm pretty sure I was great. the only one that came in there. Like I get to, everyone else to had their name chosen yeah. for them. And I was like, Trinity. As a creative, I was like, I want to decide my name. Alexis Michelle and Ryan Stardust. Those are good. Booty Jets. <laughs> Sasha Velour and Donatella Velour. I Donatella love Velour. those. I love Sasha's luck. We're two East Coast sisters in the 1940s looking to make it big in Hollywood. <laughs> the fact that they have a backstory, I love, that's I amazing. I love it. Sasha and Donatella Velour. The backstory has just made those costumes amazing. Oh, oh. Yeah! Oh shit, I That's forgot about awesome. that. Peppermint and wintergreen. The sleeve though. Yeah. <laughs> wintergreen, I love it. I love the sleeve. We're sashing. We're so shanting. She and looks like um like she should be part of Hocus like, Pocus. Okay, girl. She's sleeving on the midnight. Sisters! Yeah. I think y'all could both do really good hocus pocus. Oh my podcast. god, we could. Yeah, y'all would be really good. That's so fun. Kesha, I can't believe you got to be in the same room as Kesha. I'm I got to so hug salty. Kesha. I'm so salty. That's my one of my favorites ever. Ugh. Oh, so they combine all of our dances together? Yeah. 
I think so, right? I definitely wobble. I wonder if they show it. Oh, God. I thought there was one part I was going to fall. Oh, I almost rolled my ankle. But she didn't. That's impressive because you were in big heels, right? I was in big fucking heels. It's scary. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, yes. The most painful part of that, too, was like literally the five spanks yes. pulling on my toes shoved into that stiletto. Yeah. I could not feel my toes. I will say I didn't realize how much heels suck until I started that doing, like, hurt more than costumes. the dick taped up. Yeah. I would have taken a dick tape. I don't know for sure. Again, the heel part would have been fine. It was it was literally the tights yeah. dragging Pulling at everything. my toes yeah. and then them being shoved in the Man. heels. I was like, it's the pain. And I had to pee. I was like, oh, I have like a part. I want to get out of this tape. That's what she said. Trinity Taylor and Glitter for Day. The family resemblance is hard. God, put that divine. tooth in your and mouth. did the most intricate choreography. Yeah, so impressive. I think that was the reason we won, technically. Oh, uh, okay. I can barely walk in those shoes. Ugh, Kish is talking alone, to me. Like, Dance. Okay. Glitter. If I didn't know better, it looked like you've been doing this for a minute. And I think this was probably the tightest presentation. Is that yeah, that's why, yeah. Totally How's awesome. your tuck holding up? The pain is real. <laughs> oh, God. Is real. Now, what do you think you're going to take I from this experience? I dying. I'm going to take this tape off. Oh. <laughs> God, I can be clever when I actually try to be. And here is that. Bay kool -Aid. You know, there's uh, the star sister and then there's the other sister. Oh, oh no. I hate that it came oh, across like, you know, Bay was an afterthought. I mean, I, I didn't Shay look like the other sister. I think did a sister. great job. I'm proud to be your sister. Oh, Shut up. <laughs> up next, Shay looks Alexis great, though. Michelle and Ryan Stardust. Your brows yes. are glittered. They look great. Yeah, they do. They, they look, look awesome. so good. They, they look, look like sisters. They're absolutely giving sisters. And and Brady's just like way too excited to be there yeah, in the best way. so cute. But the outfits are kind of real basic. It oh, feels a little bit so like cute, a Ricky's Halloween costume oh. in the back. The, the teams were so sweet. The art department, they made little tags that said Team Team Aaron. You know what I mean? Oh. So, well, we always say a family that... Aaron was really together. sweet. Aaron was a shocker when they announced him. I was like, he's so quiet. Yeah. Sasha Velour and Amazing. Donatella Amazing. Velour. I was, so I was I'm like, just obsessed with the name Donatella Velour. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Now, Donatella, there is something that you're doing. It's strangely turning me on. <laughs> I learned it from watching you, dear. <laughs> yes. Up <laughs> Amazing. Next, peppermint and winter green. Yes, winter Gorgeous. green. <laughs> I know. It's just full attitude. The attitude is full Phenomenal. attitude. <laughs> Go on. Oh my god, he's so good. He's he is giving like all of the Sanderson sisters I love it. at once. I love it. Trinity Taylor and Glitifa Days. They had the most incredible choreography. The whole look, the attitudes. I was practicing. Josh was showing when we would hang out. He was like, so this is Rizzo in the back lot, like dancing and practicing in heels. I, I, and for her to hit it so hard, very impressive. In those heels, Rue. Yeah. In yeah. those mm -hmm. heels. Thank you. Shit. I was mortified that I would let Trinity down. Like yeah. genuinely, I was like, I cannot. That's sweet. I can't let her down. That's so sweet. Because that, it's yeah. like, again, her story was like one of like, I'm busting my ass to be here. And I was not about to be the straight. like, I'm not going to fuck that up for you. I was like, <laughs> I was not about to be the straight dipshit who just kind of bumble fucks like, his uh, way. Heels, what? You were no, like, I was like, no, God damn it. We're going to do this. I have to match Trinity's energy. This is, I That's will great. not be the failure here. But everybody did really, really they good. They did. None of our crew yeah. went in there with like, meh energy. Because everybody, everybody volunteered. Like nobody yeah. was forced. So it seems like everybody was there. Even Aaron. Aaron was yeah. clearly like. Everybody was there to do the damn thing. Aaron was so shaken. Uh, when Nina Bonita was kicked off, Aaron was like broken hearted about that. that he was like, this hard. is my sister. That would be hard because then you would feel like it was kind of your fault too. So yeah, nobody on our end took it lightly. And what I always say about the drag queens, these episodes are not shot every week the way that you view them. They are shot back to back to back to back. So these queens are working and are operating uh, okay. on zero sleep usually. Stress. So it's like this challenge happens and then the next day. And then the next the day next. you start the next episode. The only uh, time you don't do that is if it's like a Friday to a Monday. So it's like anytime people are like, oh, they didn't really feel energetic. They're not. <laughs>
you asshole watching from your couch. But you have to pretend. And then on top of it, Green gets the MVP. This is a point of contention. <laughs> she's a superstar from the middle. We're like talking through all this. She's amazing. The only yes. thing I did not buy what was, the point was of those outfits. So hard to look at. Just oh, the choice. I just oh. love this. They felt so disparate. The big point of disparity that I would say is that this is not one of the shows where everyone starts off on the same footing. Like, if a queen's got a lot of money, then their costumes are oh, gonna yeah, have a lot yeah, of money. That's... If a queen is not from money, then their costumes are going to reflect that. So it's kind of unfair. Even with not super like watching or knowing the show very well, I've I've heard that. Trinity Taylor, you gave us glitter for days, months, years. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh God, shut up. Congratulations. Okay, you did good. Woo! Look at you, you won. <laughs> I did not expect to win. I kind of thought you would. I remember when you said it, when you were like, dude, we won. I was like, yes. I don't want to be like that friend, but I kind of was just like, he has to win, right? Like, no way. And your drag sister has won a $2,000 gift certificate to Klein Epstein Parker. Suits made to measure. What? Damn it, I still have that suit, but yeah, it doesn't fit it? me anymore. Do you want to pause it? I picked the fabric. It's a very nice suit. I picked the inside. What's, is that ladybugs? Ladybugs for the yeah. flowers. I picked blue because I was like, I might not get money to do this again, so I'm going to pick a color that's not too... Uh, 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 that can go to things obtrusive. It can go to obtrusive. Yeah. From a distance, looks like I'm being very conservative. Up close, bam, fabulous! <laughs> Nina Bonina Brown, your bunny looks did not make the judges happy. <laughs> That's a terrible joke. I'm, I'm not happy. For elimination. Alexis Michelle, your Barbarellas were basic. Oh, but they were so cute. I know. Your makeover of Bay was not okay. Oh Ooh. God, is everything a pun room? Of course, have you watched the show? I haven't watched it, but I would assume. Alexis Michelle. You are the weakest link. Goodbye. You're safe. The time has come. Would you lip sync for your life? And don't f it up. I love this song. Would you like it's okay? I'm a little curious. Oh, Nina doesn't care. Nina, move. Move along the stage, I say as if I know how this will change the ending. Don't tell your mother. Die for each other! We're cool for the summer. The first time I heard that, I was like, that was a big jump, girl. Like, what? I've made my decision. Bye, Nina. Bye bye. I don't want to play with you anymore. Chante, you stay. Yo. Oh, uh, and Enjoy Aaron was so broken. Thank you so much. Sashay away. I was trying to be a voice for the African American community who think all they can do is just do one type of drag, but I guess I just wasn't strong enough um, oh. mentally. Well, that's rough. Oh, uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, oh, they fell in love. Thank you so much, yeah. Aaron, for, uh, for being a trooper. Look, 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 look. That Here's was so hard. Look, okay. Somebody Wait, has to go. Like I know, I know. It just is what it is. Now remember, if you can't love yourself, how in the hell are you gonna love somebody else? Can I get a man up in here? Amen. Hey, right now, let the music play. I also have Untucked pulled up. I haven't actually watched this Hamburger in forever. Hamburger Mary's. All cameras repo. <laughs> Once you like got off stage, were you like, please, please take it off, please take well, it off? You'll but notice, they were like, you'll no. notice I'm wearing the. And Trinity actually invented that little skirt. She said that wasn't just for a reveal, but that was in case you couldn't handle the tuck. Oh, and so, so you could untuck it. So just I can have untuck the it then, have the skirt on. Oh, and that's cute. Not fuck up. So I remember talking to her about it, and she was like, just stick through, because I obviously was never gonna take it off. Oh my God, I am giving a little bit of attitude there. I was walking like. Wait, go back. I feel like we did amazing. <laughs> right, that oh, there was you it. Go. There Look you at go. that. Look at I had a character. <laughs> you were like, excuse me, we're still on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Sasha's yes. got it too. Oh, I was so excited to have like a little hamburger Mary's. That's funny. I never saw this. You should have sat us all down and had us watch this part. How does everybody feel about their experience with their crew member? I think Wintergreen did a great job. I'm super proud of her. That she, she could she could perform. When you finish <laughs> yes, her she mug, could. in the work 
from that mug she was pulling. <laughs> Bitch, when I said let me look at her, we and she at looked other. at me, she <laughs> <laughs> She believes she's trying to fight me. Winter, <laughs> winter nice cream is giving I every to second. She I said. spooked myself. I kept looking at my little sister, and I was like. <laughs> yes. It's it's cute too because this can be a very solitary experience, especially just in this environment where it's like it's obviously they're all friends, but at the same time you're like competing. Yeah. So like to be able to be like you, you're mine. You, yeah. you, you're friends with me, right? Yeah. You're my sister. <sighs> like, that's that's kind of cute. It's wholesome. That's wholesome. I feel like every straight man should have to be paired with a drag queen at some point in their life. Yes. It sounds like the best Disney Channel original movie ever. <laughs> Rizzo is, for the most part, he was a lot easier than the rest of y'all because of his build. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But that face. The face was not no, easy. The face no, no, was no, not yeah, easy. No, I give you way credit for that. That face. You scored you. That, that, face, that, face. that face was not easy. No. Y'all already know I have like a crush on Rizzo. <laughs> and that was like, part of it. And I was like, and I was like how am I going to, how am I going to be this right. close to him mm -hmm. and like, <laughs> not like wet myself. Not slip him but a roofie. I, I, but the thing is, is like, <laughs> canceled. As soon as like we started, Basically like hours. I could tell that he was really serious. And yeah. then it, it, then obviously like I'm very serious oh, about drag in this competition. So it like that's it funny. He literally said that. Like, even when I had to tuck, like help him tuck. It's like that penis doesn't attract me anymore. Yeah. <laughs> And not in a sexy way. Now I kind of look at him as my sister, so I'm got, kind of turned off now. I'm like, no. hey, I'm so attractive. Oh, wow. She just said you're her sister now. And so Whoa, now you've that never you're been attracted to your sister. Wow. Uh, Hello, ladies. What? Burger. <laughs> ladies, gather around. Mary's. Oh my God. Still working. You're still doing the job. I want He's that good. fucking burger gather up, now. ladies. Do I see a vegetarian it's option? Oh, oh, honey. You sure do. No. God damn, I want burger right now. I'm just waiting for you to like go in on a burger. <laughs> I'm trying to watch you to see like how. Come over here. How sweet and lady like you're gonna be. Or oh, you're not gonna. I don't <laughs> Rizzo, how is your tuck now that you were ab gone? Ab you were gone. Ab gone. Did you make it no, she put that skirt back on. Oh. <laughs> it's gone. Is your dick just hanging oh, out you now? You made her a skirt? Yeah, well, we had skirts to begin with and ripped them off. Oh, they had a reveal. We had a reveal. Thank God, no. not a Show, Yeah, we already heard that, Rizzo. Shut the fuck up. It's fine. You I'm being you, mean to my. You're like, I, I'm new. I just want a burger. I want to lay down. I'm being so mean to I 2016 didn't sign up for this, Rizzo. Except I really did. I want those burgers now. Look at me. Going in on another burger. <laughs> I'm already there. I'm like, mm. so You're like, excuse me. I, I already finished. I mean, I've always known what y'all do is difficult. And it's so It's impressive. so different it's doing oh. it. It's absolutely different I mean, doing it. Sarge, though, is. I've always been amazed by. Was one of those people where it's like as a cameraman was phenomenal because he was like, I'm going to get in there. Yeah. I'm like, so like he was working hard too. Yeah. Like they were working hard. Sarge was working hard. But it's like, it's so, it's interesting because it's like you can work so hard, but then you switch positions oh, I know. and you're just like, whoa. They should have done a full switch. Drag queens are now the crew. No. No, that's a terrible idea. Give the drag queens cameras. <laughs> Come on, fuck you. I'm not doing that. <laughs> Are you asleep back there? No, I'm listening. That's a focused a face. And now I'm drinking. You gonna give me more shit, Benji? Yes, absolutely. That's what I'm here to do. I give myself shit. That was great. That was super fun because we did, uh, we went to Mickey's in West Hollywood to watch the premiere of it with everybody. It was fun. We didn't watch this though. Has anything changed? Uh, after this experience for the crew queens, this question is question this one. Definitely. It's, it's Ladies, five minutes, five minutes. Oh, Thank Josh five. Spiegel. Oh, wait, did we see him? Yeah, he just it. passed through. Sashay away. Thank you. That's not on oh. me. No, I know. It's way oh. tougher when you're so part of sad. it. Right? Yeah. Oh. You feel invested. Because you feel guilty, yeah, that too, point. that you did something seven. wrong. Piercing and pierced that I could put my whole thumb through your ears. But you're a sensitive guy. You know, people say, oh, don't take this personal. That's you know, so sad. With somebody. Look at him, he cares. They care. Oh. Legacy. Uh, you know what what it's you hard. Doing? Like, this means the world <laughs> to them. You're really warm. And my hands are cold. <laughs> you can't love yourself. How the hell are you going to love somebody else? <laughs> yeah, you good, Benji? Yeah. Are you? We don't see I think we're okay. good. All we right, that's it. it. We oh did it. God, I haven't watched that in 
for fucking ever. You were really hard on yourself. You were like not about watching yourself. That's funny. Whatever. He's ah. cute, but I, I've moved on, all right? I'm a different person. I got tattoos. You do have tattoos. I'm so cool now. <laughs> I'm glad we watched that. It was a great throwback. And here's the thing. The world was so different, even just three years ago, let yeah. alone yeah. back in 2016 when I filmed it. I just recently moved from Texas, back from Texas. I was still Christian at the time, but I wasn't fully Christian. I said some things behind the scenes. I said a joke that definitely now would be incredibly transphobic. And thankfully, one of the trans queens heard and went, what the f and called me out and Duncan had to give me a guy, like a fucking talking to was like, why did you say that? I was like, I thought it was funny. Were you being a no, dick? Well, it wasn't being a dick. I thought- But you, were, you weren't like, oh, I, I just trans wasn't people. You were just like, I didn't realize that I was wasn't offensive. aware yeah. of the offense. Yeah. And then I got called out and I got a fucking talking to. And that happened. That's one of the reasons I really enjoyed working on that show is because I learned so much from it. So that's one of the reasons I look back on that experience with a lot of fondness is because like I yeah. wouldn't be who I am had it not been for a little bit of talking to from the queens. Yeah, and honestly, I mean, even just the pop stars keeping us accountable yeah. for things that we say. I always feel like I'm very open to people. Like, I would never intentionally like laugh at somebody because I hate them, but it's like you laugh because it's like you don't understand something. And then people are like, hey, don't do that. And you're and just like, always like oh, shut up. Fuck, my bad. <sighs> you're right. Oh. That was two different reactions. Right. <laughs> well, mine's <laughs> always are like, Ugh! Uh, you're but, right. Yeah. And then it's, or it's like, it just like, a, oh, fuck. Yeah. I didn't think about that. You're right. But it's like something you have to learn. And it's like something that if you're in the spotlight at an early age and you just kind of like don't realize that, you, you, you gotta, you, you get fucked up a lot. But it's, it's good. And that's, um, I had something else. No, I think I, you said it very eloquent. Eloquently. Eloquently. We're always learning and it's always about just being able to realize when like, oh no, I did fuck up and I can do better. I'll always look back on that experience and I'm appreciative of this now. So thank you, pop stars. If you want to see the full unedited episode, it's on Patreon, $5, full reaction. Until then, I'm Rizzo. I'm Benji. Sweet dreams, pop stars. Keep watching. And if you can't love yourself, how, how the, the hell are you gonna love, love somebody else? else? All right. <laughs> I don't watch a lot of RuPaul, but I did when I quit my job to do this full time. Uh -huh. I wrote on the mirror in lipstick. Like I went to the CVS across the street, bought a cheap lipstick and wrote across the mirror. Like, no. see y'all later. Oh yeah, I do remember that. You have a picture of it, right? <laughs> yeah, right here. <laughs>